New tonight, we're following blockbuster developments in the murder-suicide case from Henrietta that shocked the state and the nation really this week. Seven people dead, including five children. Today, News Force Kaylee Olivas got a look inside the house where four of the bodies were found. She joins us now with more. Kaylee. Well, before we even begin, we want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see is disturbing. This afternoon, News 4 was invited by Ivy Webster's family with the permission of the property owner to tour the home of Jesse McFadden. Inside was a true house of horror. Throughout the house, there were restraints, sex toys, drug paraphernalia, and evidence left behind by law enforcement. The Oklahoma State Bureau of Investigation has been the lead on the case, but they had released the property and there wasn't an active investigation as of Tuesday afternoon. Just minutes after we entered the home with the family, victim cell phones were found along with two laptops. All of the evidence we saw today has now been collected by investigators. But it begs the question of why it was all left behind. We're now carefully reviewing the tremendous amount of video footage we took while inside the home. And tomorrow, we'll have a full report of this unusual development. A lot more to come. Thank you, Kaylee.